Alright, what's up gamers? <laughs> We're playing Five Nights at Freddy's for some reason. You know, now that I think about it, I really don't like this game. <laughs> okay, so we have to start out by me going into my honest opinion of this game. Oh my god, it was just going at like... <laughs> Look at the frames per second! Pff, holy crap. <laughs> 2,653, just in case you couldn't see it for whatever reason. Ew. All the pixels. Well, it's, it's like this normally, it's not... Really? I guess mm -hmm. I haven't played them. Okay. So, anyway, my honest opinion of this game, right? Don't... It's just a strat for night one. That's all you need to do. Um... Oh, phone guy. Shut up, phone guy. Mm. Watch this, watch this, watch this, right? Mm. Stop! Me boop, <laughs> boop, boop. There we hey. go. Hey! <laughs> hey! <laughs> but, um... Anyway, I... I honestly love the first game. I think that it was a very... Especially for, like, 2014, 2015, when it originally came out. I thought it was a very interesting take on what was the horror genre at the time. Because, like, the only really, like, popular game you'd have had up until that point is Slender, right? So it's like... Oh, yeah. You're basically just sitting here in silence for most of the time, which sounds boring, but it's like, in making a horror game, it's very tense. Now, full full confession here, we are not wearing headphones, we're not playing this in the ideal way, so jump scares probably aren't going to be as effective, but... Well, yeah, we still won't be expecting it, really. Mm. I guess you're right. So, basically, at this point, um... I, I the, obviously the fan base of this game is one of the worst things I've ever seen. I mean, most of them have grown out of it by now, so. Uh, yeah, that's actually true. I I went on the uh, FNAF subreddit recently because it was like being discussed at some point, and it's apparently like the community recovered somehow by some miracle of nature. Do you have like a mouse pad or something? Do you want a mouse pad? Uh, preferably. Do we have one? Mm hmm. Here, I'll just hold it. Implying that I don't have, like, any computer component at any given time. <laughs> okay, foxes are active during the first night, so that's good. No joke. Uh, okay, so FNAF 1 and FNAF 4 are the scariest games, in my opinion. I've never played um, 4. I've never even seen it played. Dude, I don't... I, we're not playing 4 on the channel. <laughs> we're doing 1, 2, 3, sister location. Possibly VR. You, where'd my orange drink go? If if it like if we get access to FNAF VR, we'll play it. We probably will. Right. There we go. His okay. So his nose hit box is right. Freddy's there. a disjoint. <laughs> okay. It's just exposition. Mm. Oh, you can mute the call still. <laughs> now it's just. What is even going on? <laughs> It's just, just sitting here looking at this. Yeah, it's it, really nothing happens the first night, which is why I wanted to play the first night. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Um. Yeah. We're switching nights, by the way. So Aiden, Aiden's playing the first, third, and fifth night. I'm playing second, fourth, and sixth. So. Speaking of FNAF, uh, mm -hmm. I played FNAF three the most because I had all of them on my phone. Um, gonna stay on Foxy just in case. And going to winter retreat on the way, I was sitting with Grant Dubler, and I got through all of FNAF 3, and then I three-starred it somehow. Like, FNAF 3, like, once you get to, like, because you can customize mm -hmm. it, you have to turn him all the way up and stuff. It is really hard. Like, but the thing is, you're only dealing with one animatronic. Yeah, so but that's the what phantoms, I think they are. They, okay, they're only there for, like, jump scares, and you have to, like, reset your, uh, whatever oh. it's called. So, full. I've I've played the first one a lot, actually. Well, a lot for, like, how long the game is. Um, and then the second one I've played, like, a little bit. And I'm pretty familiar with both of them. I thought the second one was actually a pretty good continuation of the first one. The third one was unnecessary. The fourth one was unnecessary. The I think there are five. Are there five? Yes. Well, there, they okay. were unnecessary. There's five. There's custom one. There's a pizzeria simulator. 
Wait, what? What? Okay, we're good. No. I thought one of them was looking at me funny. Also, Which just a reminder saying? that Five Nights at Freddy's 2 released less than a year after Five Nights at Freddy's 1. They kept going. And, like, any time MatPat would make a new video, they drop. Basically. Well, it's like... <laughs> that was the good old days of game theory. We hit the Mr. Theories. Krab scenario of what inspired you to release a second Five Nights at Freddy's so close to the release of the first one. Money. Money. <laughs> good on you, Scott Carlton. <laughs> Yeah, they're not necessarily bad games. It was it was really just a fan base. It's okay. So it seems like maybe every few years or so. Oh frick! You oh. do it to watch Foxy. Yeah, you do. Honestly, I'm I gonna. <laughs> wow, what a gamer. Okay, so it's an interesting pattern of games that have been kind of like ruined by um, the fan bases, right? So. You have, I think my, I'd like to say Minecraft is where it really started. I know there were games before that that had bad fan bases, but Minecraft is the first one where it was like, yeah. you can still look at it and say, wow, that was freaking bad. Um, and then that was, Minecraft was bad maybe 2012-ish. Yeah. And then 2014 was Five Nights at Freddy's. Mm. 2016 was Undertale, and then 2018 was Fortnite. So I'm curious to see what the next one's gonna what, be. What what will 2020 hold for us? What do you say? Your predictions? What genre of game? Even? 2020. Okay, so we had first off we had Sandbox World, then we had horror, horror then we had RPG, RPG, then we had Battle Royale shooter game. We we'll say a really annoying platformer. Hmm. Mm, I don't think platformer. I think the platformer like is an old online enough. platformer. I, I don't even think that though. I think it's like because it, it's single player. Or, what's, what do you think? Well, I don't freak. I'm thinking. Give me a second here. <laughs> Honestly, oh, no, nope, Bonnie moved. On. Check, check the door. I'm just gonna. Okay, so the thing is, if you keep the door on the whole night and don't do anything, you'll run out of power. You'll be fine. No, no, not the first night. Oh well. Um, so, found him. Um, I don't know. I would probably say, like, oh, no, I can tell you what 2010 was. It was Call of Duty. Oh, yeah. Still started pumping out those games. Well, Call of Duty is still bad. That's the one that never recovered. Undertale is respectable, at least nowadays. Yeah. Fortnite... It, it's not had time. We'll see yeah, what it's like in, in like 2024. We'll see if it. Okay. Thank you, Golden Freddy. Very cool. <laughs> in 2024, we'll see if it's um anywhere close to remembered fondly. But... Oh frick! No, he's not there. I know he's not there. Is he there? Check Foxy. For yeah. Foxy's fine. I don't even know how we got the it's me thing because we didn't go to the Golden Freddy room. It's random. I'm pretty sure. Um, but uh, let's see. So, in terms of genres. Oh, Chica's gone. Frick! Check the light first. Oh, I'm just gonna. We're, we're, we're gonna be fine for Double Door right now. <laughs> we have 20% left. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, Aiden doesn't know how to play this game. Not gonna lie. Sorry, I know Aiden, how to play but... this game. I just want to get jump scared. <laughs> you close the door first, and then they can't get you. It's a flawless plan. Exactly. Oh, yes. Hmm. Apparently, the ambiance changes depending on how close they get to you, which is interesting. Like, it's it's almost completely silent when they're all in the one room, and then it, like, changes to white noise if they're in the cafeteria, and then it changes to, like, weird... Okay. Um... <laughs> we did it! <laughs> Ooh, brief period of uh, almost uh. 2,000 frames per second again. Need to update my hardware. <laughs> mm. All right, again. scoot. No, scoot this way. But yeah, that's what I'm doing. Okay. All yeah, right. We're very we're weirdly uh, transitioning this. Yeah. Well, we're we're doing what we can. So we'll listen to the call. The call is yeah, most important. Uh, which is what's? Is he already? What? Oh, okay. I was gonna say. Oh, Frick. God. 
I don't think she'll be there yet. Okay, I gotta remember how to play. Hello. Hello. Mm. I won't talk quite as long this time. You know, she could look kind of thick, though. Go back to boxing. <laughs> Extra thick. I, I know how to play. I know. Also, this game is no fun if you um, don't use it to check for gold. This, this, this game is no fun if you don't check the cameras. Like, I know you... Oh, hello. Okay. Where's Bonnie? Holy f... Where can you move that fast? What? Where did Bonnie go? I don't like where those are going. Oh, they're in that hallway there. Where? There. Where? There. Where? Where? Oh, they're not there anymore. Uh... Hmm. It's weird. Whoops. Yeah, Bonnie's typically only spawns on the left. Well, typically is like only, like... Where the frick did you go? There. Oh. Hello. Okay. Okay, found him. <laughs> yeah, crisis averted. Okay, so the one flaw in this game is that you never actually have to check the doors, or you never have to check the camera other than Foxy and Ghost Stage. Mm -hmm. Like, you literally can just do... Yeah, you're kind of draining the, uh... Shut the freak up. I'm gonna, like, sit here staring at the fan, though. No. Yeah. Gotta look at the interesting stuff. Might be Chica. No freaking you stop doing that! Because I'm using the camera too much? What's going on? Hmm. Oh, <laughs> hello. Okay, so he's in that supply closet there. <laughs> okay. Oh stop. It might be yeah. I don't like where this is going. Alright, so she probably Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> you had to get that Instagram check in there. It's called I check my phone so I don't have to be scared. Where did you go, Chica? I hear something weird. Oh, that's the kitchen. Yeah, so okay, yeah, I forgot you can tell if Chica's in the kitchen. Sorry if we're not talking, you need to listen. Yeah. And I'm a little uh, scared. Frick! Don't be scared. Frick! Hello. Can't outreact me, boy. Where'd she go? He's still there. Move! Can you see Chica in there? Thank you for using all my power. The oh, frick, man? <laughs> it's just waiting for Bonnie to leave. You, you mind? She's in the kitchen. Go. Move. Crap. Yeah, we're just gonna have to. He's not there anymore. Yeah. You just go back to the showroom? No, Foxy's not moved. Oh, dang. We need to really conserve power. Yeah, I was like, yeah, I was like, why are you checking all the cameras so much there? I don't. Does Freddy move second night? Do you no, know? No, I think he moves third night. Thank you. Still in the kitchen. Mm. I'm just gonna not check Foxy for a little bit so he can conserve power. He doesn't seem to be moving. Well, we're at 3 a.m. and at 36. Yikes. Hmm. 
I feel like this would be a better stream game. It might be. Uh, you just won't be checking the cameras. Never mind all that. <laughs> You don't really have to check them. It's not very fun, but what what else isn't very fun is losing, so... Yeah. Progress is nifty. 20... Oh, boy. <laughs> Nine to Friday, second night. You're not gonna... Well, okay. Or I am. Yeah, we can clutch this. As long as I get, like, good RNG and they don't, like, attack me. Yeah. Any commentary in your end, Aiden? Dog, I just want to get through this night. <laughs> Again, FNAF kind of, uh, yeah. <laughs> I don't know, it just gets to me. I'm not a big fan of horror. That's why my really? only horror movie that I like is It, because it's more of a comedy than a horror movie. Really? Oh yeah, it's great. I love it so much. Foxy's just not moved. Okay. Don't complain about that. Well, twenty percent four a.m. All right, we sh should be fine. <laughs> as long as it changes to five a.m. by fifteen, we can clutch it out even just by letting the timer run out. Or if, he, if he's, like, in there, if you just don't move with it. Yeah. Ah, <laughs> oh, back and Innovative forth light gameplay. checking. Alright, change to 5 a.m., please. Frick. Well, we might be clutching really hard. Okay. There we go. There we go. So. Break something moved. Pirate Cove is quiet. Okay, I think that we'll be fine. Well, we'll we be really freaking close. We there will be music playing at six a.m. Mm -hmm. But well, either way, even when you win. Hmm. 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 I like how this is going. The full Where are they? Which, I don't know. I don't know what's going on. God, all right. Yeah. Okay, it looks like we're gonna be fine. Right. Okay. We could just. We might be able to just leave that door down. We're just gonna yeah, sit we'll here. To. Oh. Oh, jeez. So. What was that? Okay. Be prepared to uh, have Freddy uh, peek his head in here. I think we'll get to. Oh, okay, now Wait, he's. Is it, is it open? Did he move? A little okay. bit. As long as he's not out of there, we're good. And oh boy. Change to six. What? How are we at zero and it's not? <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh. <sighs> Frick, if this is only night two. <laughs> And I have to oh, we're doing it. we're doing uh, two episodes per night. So thank you for watching, everyone. Um, a little bit stressful. So right, tune in next time. There.